Hi, I'm Dr. Jennifer Gola, and I'm a licensed clinical psychologist at the Center for Emotional Health of Greater Philadelphia. I'd like to take a few minutes to talk about how to reduce touching your face. We are all aware of the advice to avoid touching your face to reduce your risk of getting COVID-19. Just knowing this, however, is not enough. We touch our face often without realizing it, up to one to three times a minute, and focusing on not touching your face can make you feel the urge to touch your face even more. Do you notice the urge right now? There's a simple method for significantly reducing face touching or other self-focused behavior we do with little awareness. Keep track of your face touching. Choose a way to track that is highly visible and you can carry around with you easily whether it be a sheet of paper, a tally counter app or note on your phone, or a golf counter, and record every time you touch your face. Within minutes, the rate will drop low and stay low as long as you continue to count. Soon, just the presence of the piece of paper or counter will remind you not to touch your face. If you would like a different or additional way to bring awareness to face touching, try using a perfume or strong smelling lotion on your wrist. A bracelet or band that makes noise when it moves or is a bright color or something similar to catch your attention when your hand goes to your face. When first putting it on, bring your hand to your face and think about making the connection between the smell or object and bringing your hand back down to solidify that association. If you find it difficult to resist touching your face, even when you are aware, think about the function of the behavior. Did you have an itch to scratch? Did you feel fidgety and touching your face is also keeping your hands occupied? Did you feel your lips chapped and want to pick them? Recognizing your cues to touching your face can help you find a replacement behavior when you notice the urge. For instance, in response to an itch, you can put on hand sanitizer first, use your shoulder to scratch, or ride out the urge. For face touching in response to being bored or nervous, try keeping your hands busy with a fidget toy or jewelry to play with. Practical solutions could be found as well, such as pulling your hair back if you find your hair is tickling your face, wearing your glasses if you find you're rubbing your eyes a lot from dry contacts, or manicuring your nails if you're prone to nail biting. I hope you found this useful. Please feel free to share it. My colleagues and I at CEH are dedicated to specialized care in the evidence-based treatment of anxiety disorders, OCD, and related disorders, and neurodevelopmental disorders. And we are able to provide telehealth via secure internet video conferencing. Thank you for watching. Be well.